Tesla Motors CEO Elon Musk last night unveiled the company's Model X sport utility vehicle at its Fremont, California factory. The new all-electric SUV seats seven has rear Falcon wing doors that open even next to another car and which use a new sonar technology that goes through metal to avoid touching a low ceiling in a garage. Musk claimed the Model X to be the fastest and the safest SUV ever. It goes from zero to 60 in 3.2 seconds flat and scoring roughly twice as high on safety tests than the second safest SUV, again, according to Elon Musk. He also emphasized sophisticated air filtering, including a bio defense mode button, which turns the entire car into a kind of gas mask for its occupants. The price of the Model X is expected to be roughly $75,000 to as high as $144,000 for a fully loaded signature version. Kevin, how badly do you want this car? I mean, I just, I just, I just need it. What, what, what did you think about this announcement? Well, I mean, this this is perfect for when The Walking Dead becomes reality, you Absolutely. know, and you need that bio defense mode button and all that. Uh, exactly. I, I love what Musk is doing. He's really pushing the envelope, maybe in ways that we think are head scratchers at times. But um, I mean, I, I don't know that I'd need an, uh, I, I want an, a safe SUV, but I don't need it to go to zero to 60 in 3.2. But, you know, that's that kind of speed is inherent with any electric vehicle because of the instant torque. So um, I don't really have a problem with it. The bigger issue for most people is going to be the price. I mean, if you're talking about up to $144,000 for this, um, you're certainly not going to see these all over the roads, I wouldn't think, uh, no matter how much they tout the, the leasing and the attractiveness of not paying for gas and so on. Um, I think they're going to have a much bigger hit with their less expensive uh, upcoming vehicle. But it's interesting. I, I, I definitely give them credit. Yeah, absolutely. And it had all kinds of little goodies. Like, for example, when you walk up to the door, uh, like a, you know any sort of other car, it recognizes that you're there and you can unlock it very easily. But in this case, uh, the Tesla will actually open the, the driver door and close it when you get in. You don't have to touch the door at all, uh, even as you walk up to a locked car. Uh, very cool. They had a, 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 a easy-to-attach um, sort of bicycle rack on the back. They demonstrated the car uh, by hauling in this heavy uh, sort of Airstream trailer, and then seven people got out, and then they unloaded a ton of luggage. And very theatrically, they unloaded all the luggage from the back, and then they went around to the front where, in a conventional car, the engine is, and opened that up and pulled a bunch of luggage out of there too because, <laughs> of course, the, the motors are, are uh, low, which, by the way, added, adds to safety. And uh, much smaller than a than a, uh, a gas powered uh, motor or engine, and uh, you know, just it it was a great presentation as usual for Elon Musk. They gave a, you know they they had the first uh, low VIN number cars um, had the owners walk up and 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 uh, drive off with their new cars. Uh, but yeah, it was a, I thought it was a great announcement. And once again, I think that Tesla was the first to have a real uh, sports car on the market that was uh, all electric. Now it's the first to have an all electric. SUV and 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 again this is a this is a trail blazing car. I was particularly interested in all the safety claims that he made, some of which were just purely great engineering if all that is to be believed, and some of it is just inherent safety with electric vehicles. He made the point that a lot of uh, a lot of injury and crashes, especially head-on crashes, are the result of the 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 engine block coming into the passenger compartment, which doesn't mm -hmm. happen. Uh, with an electric vehicle like a Tesla, and also the fact that uh, the, you know the, he had mind-blowing rollover numbers, and he points out that all the weight in, a, in an electric car like this is very low in the car, unlike a regular SUV, where it's much much higher, and so rollover is very difficult or very uh, unlikely. So I, I was impressed uh, by all the claims, uh, 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 particularly because claims like this for Tesla cars in the past have actually pr been proved in third-party objective uh, testing. Yeah, I mean, that's why I'm saying he, he is definitely pushing this market forward. Other car makers, traditional car manufacturers, they have to take notice of Tesla, even if they're far vastly outselling Tesla here. Um, there are so many design features and um, unique qualities to these cars that really, at some point in, in the near future, you would hope would be in all cars. I mean. I don't want to say every car costs $140,000. Obviously, it takes time to filter these technologies and safety factors in. But clearly, um, the, the car manufacturers, I think, have been put on notice from a, a design and innovation perspective. Oh, absolutely. Well, and anyway, once again, I will reiterate, I need one. So, that's all I can say. <laughs> just, just one? At least, at least. Maybe a fleet. <laughs>